Good morning, Freeport. Good morning, morning from Freeport. We just right peeked out. I know we just peeked out the window and saw some birds and stuff. Yeah. Anyway, we are all in beach mode because we have an excursion this morning, but we also have champagne breakfast this morning. So we feel a little underdressed for champagne breakfast. We didn't know we were going though, so no. hopefully they don't care if we're wearing shorts. I have a dress, but I want to wear it tonight and I don't want to have to change and change again. And yeah, get it. I don't know if there was a dress code. We can be but, scrubs. It's cool. Yeah, but we have an excursion too, so that's weird. But I think they'll be fine with it. We'll see. We'll see, but we're going to go check out this breakfast. I don't know how much it is yet. We'll have to see if we can find out. You know, if you want to buy it. I think it's 12 something. I don't know. We'll, okay. we'll definitely try we and find make out. Stuff if we don't know it. <laughs> okay. But our excursion today that we got through the ship is we're going to Grand Lucayan Resort. I think it's Lighthouse Point at yes. Grand Lucayan Resort Correct. for a day pass. We're excited because that's what we wanted to do anyway. Yeah. It, uh, it doesn't really include any food or mm -hmm. any extras, but it was like super cheap. Just, you know, transportation to and from, mm -hmm. usage of chairs, infinity pool, a beach. Because hot tubs, you have the Ooh. option. There's several restaurants on right. site and things like that. So we'll show you all about Something it. Something different that we've yeah. never done in Freeport before. A lot of people go there, though. All right, but let's start with breakfast. Yes. Roll out. Time to go. Oh, coffee. I know. <laughs> Good morning, little water bottle. Good morning, pens. It sounds all fancy and we're in scrub clothes. We passed the test. We were allowed to eat breakfast. We've got a Bellini and a Rossini. Look at this cute little setup here and this enormous menu. I mean, there is a ton of food on this menu. I cannot even process it this morning. Cute, we've got little individual buckets of marmalade, strawberry preserves, and grape jelly. <laughs> What the heck? We are gonna get copyrighted by Disney. I, but I just thought it was hilarious. All of a sudden it came on and I'm like, that's Christopher Robin plays. They're playing Winnie the Pooh, y'all. Here, look, I think it's nice. look at Freeport. Can we look at Freeport? Wow, let's look at Freeport while listening to Winnie the Pooh. Love it. Now they're playing Peter Pan. What's this, like a Disney breakfast? I feel a little special right now. <laughs> it's like if you go to like one of the fancy character meet and greets at like the Royal Table. They knew you were coming this morning. I'm They're enjoying like, life right now. break out the Disney hits for D. Okay, that's enough of that. Bye. The Disney breakfast continues. It's Pocahontas. <laughs> wow. Yep. omelet. Mm -hmm. I got this nice breakfast skillet, French toast, I don't even know. So much stuff. <laughs> I know Dee's gonna sing this one. Here she goes. It's frozen. I knew she's gonna sing it. She needs to just let it go, okay? Don't don't sing every Disney song that comes on. Just let it go. Mm -mm. No, no. It's Dee's Little Mermaid, because you are a Little Mermaid. Maybe today the water's not too cold. We'll Hopefully, see. I know. Yeah, there's a lot of food. Um, I did finish everything except my tomato was a little too much. The portions are huge. They really are. So we ask to see how much it is to purchase on your own. It's $19 per person. So not a bad day, not a bad deal. It's pretty good value. Yeah. Freeport. Uh, there we go, Freeport. <laughs> Coming for you. All right, we're leaving our Disney no. breakfast. I know. It was like almost all Disney songs the whole time we were in there. That was my favorite breakfast ever. That's funny. So here is the paper that we got about how to connect to the internet. Apparently, you don't have to buy it ahead of time. You just click on Grand Celebration Wi-Fi, pops the screen up. You enter some information in there and choose which package you want to purchase. And that's about how it works. Now, sadly, the internet has not actually worked um, for us because when we went down to talk to guest services and she said it was broken. 
so hopefully it will be fixed at some point on our voyage, but this is how it works when it works. Well, it did pop the little screen back up today. I know the internet has not been working, but there's the screen that you normally get when you tap Grand Celebration and you hit sign up for internet access. So I guess we'll see if it's working. See, last name, room number, birth month, birth year. Nope, still getting this weird error message. So I think that means that their internet is officially still broken. Wah, wah. We'll take it to Freeport with us today and see if they have Wi-Fi. Hey, look, there's me. <laughs> Well, we're killing some time before we go meet for our excursion in the sports uh, club. Let's look in the indulgent spa and salon. I think this is where the gym is up here. Gotcha. There's a little salon area. Hey, I see people in the gym. Oh, beauty parlor. Get your nails did. Haircut. They got some like massage tables. Oh, that's cool. And we have the Ship Shape Fitness Club. Oh, Dia's already jumping on the equipment. How did I know she would do that? Stop it. They got some jazzy fitness club up here. This is for short legs and Oh gosh, do you know the seat adjusts backwards? Oh. That's fine. <laughs> so we got some exercise bikes, some like weights types machines. That's what that's called. Treadmills overlooking the ocean. Yeah, there's a little yoga ball. Something's called exercise ball. There's me in the gym. That's a sight you don't see too often. Oh, we didn't have appropriate sportswear, but we didn't use the machines for more than 20 minutes, so I not too bad. Closed I think it yeah. That's us. Our meeting point for our tour is the Crow's Nest Sports Bar slash Disco Club. They got the dance tunes of bumping. You can just rock out, well, dance out while you're waiting for your excursion. Woo! We're official. This would go with my hat so well. Too bad I did not bring my hat. Dang! Makes sense. They'll do their safety drills while we're here in Freeport. Welcome to Freeport. Now there are no other ships uh, in with us today that I'm aware of, but this is a different location than we normally dock. The Bahamas Paradise ship uses this slightly side location. So we'll have to see, cause the, well, this looks vaguely familiar. Goodbye, grand celebration. We'll see you soon. Lighthouse Point at Grand Lucayan Resort. Yeah, true. Good views over there. But yeah, so if we choose to go to Lucaya Marketplace, you can get picked up over there, or we might spend the entire day here because, well, that's how we roll. In my hoodie. <laughs> In your hoodie. It rained on us a little bit during the drive, but the sun has come out now, so it's looking nice. It's supposed to be what 80, 80 today. I'll take my hoodie off. Yeah, no hoodie needed. I guess this is where we'll be spending the day. They look like they've got some eating venues up there. Here's a pool. That's a lap. That's a lap pool. That's not an infinity pool. That's a finite pool. Finity? No, that doesn't work. Hey, look, you can play a uh, shuffleboard. Oh, she found it. Oh, yeah. Yes, there is at least one seagull in the infinity pool. That's awesome looking. Up oh, loungers. You got some birds taking up residence there. I guess is this uh, some kind of a jacuzzi warm thing? Looks like one. You got like giant chess and or checkers hanging out over here. That's a huge property. 
Dee has found our residence for the day. I like how she picked the two loungers that aren't really quite with any of the other. That's true. You don't want to be jammed in the middle. All right, well, we got our own personal VIP loungers. A little bit wavy, but we'll have to see if we're going to get any snorkel action today. Definitely going to have some pool action, I have a feeling. Got a bar and grill over there with a couple of ping pong tables if you want to play some windy ping pong. Adds an extra level of challenge to the game. Nice little stretch of beach. They do have some waves coming in and of course a bunch of birds ready to play volleyball with us. So I do love playing volleyball with my cacao friends. D is going to give us a coldness test. See how we're looking. Oh! That's refreshing. That sounded like a refreshing noise. I mean, it's not bad. You can get used to it. By the end of the day. Yeah. Now Dee has already entered the pool. She's got a head start on me because I was applying my sunscreen. There she is over there. I don't think she got properly sunscreened up because she probably put on some face stick, but she did not ask me to put anything on her back. So hopefully she does not turn into a toasty little lobster out here. Mercy. Anyway, we're getting ready to start with infinity pool mode and join our little friend the birds here. Hey birds. Oh, bye, bye birds. Hello ma'am, I caught up to you. Hi. What you doing out here in this pool? It's an infinity pool. Without your back properly sunscreened. Oh yeah, crap. See? I knew you were going to turn into a little lobster. <laughs> I gotta do that. You better quit that. I don't want to get out of gold. Yeah, I know. Well, nice. we in it now. The best view pool I've ever seen. Yeah, I mean, you could just look out at the ocean and just pretend you're in it. But you know, there's no fish in here, but there's also no waves in here and no rocks. So you can swim right up to the edge and then boop. Oh, well, I accidentally just happened to pick the part with the broken drain, but anyway. She's going for a rescue here. We got to keep all the sea turtles that could be in the pool safe. Got it. It's cold. <laughs> all right. So, any turtles that come in this water, they're going to be safe. Pool turtles. All right, I made it down. You just got to do it. You just got to commit to it. Get into the chilly water. But once you're down here, it doesn't take too long to get used to it. He says as he froze us. Anyway, let's do our what are we at? Lighthouse Point Grand Lucayan spin with D in the background getting back in the pool. She had to go rescue that cup. Do the right thing. They do have showers on either end. We noticed there's some sand in the pool, but yeah, they've got showers for people to properly wash off. I threw it away. Good job, yeah. Cool. Well done. You can play an infinite amount of volleyball with the seagulls from the pool yeah you can probably if they hit the ball hard enough you could just be like I don't want to hurt them. knock it well you don't hurt them they're playing you know you just <laughs> knock it back over there to them well they got a guy on a microphone up there announcing the games ping pong oh hula hoop cool we're wandering over here now to the waves bar and grill i like how the swim shorts on the a kind of look like pizza but maybe that's just if you're hungry. I think it's not It's not probably supposed to be pizza. <laughs> Unless maybe they sell pizza up here. Oh gosh, he is really excited. You're doing it? Nah, nah, go ahead, go for it. You gotta suffer before you get out. That's really cool. Yeah. Oh, it got warm right here. Did somebody, did somebody just pee pee over here? No. Nobody's over here, so it must be either you or me and it wasn't me. Uh, hmm, suspect, suspect. All right, let's come check this place out. I got a nice little sampling of 750 cocktails. Yeah. Oh, the food. Nice. All right, I decided to go with a hammer time and Dee got a bay breeze. Because mm -hmm. she's a bay. And it's breezy. There you go. We're trying to check out the pool rules to see if you can actually have your plastic cups in the pool. It looks like you can, except item number uh, five says do not use if you have consumed alcohol. Uh-oh. Hmm. Well, just to be safe, we are going to come pop a squat. Is that what you say, or does that mean go to the bathroom? We're going to sit down. We're going to sit in a chair, consume our drinks, and then pretend like we didn't have them, and then get back in the pool. Responsibility. That's right. The turtles would not want us having our plastic straws in their pool. Well, we've enjoyed our beverages. We're going to walk over here now and get some sunscreen on this lady's back before she turns crispy. <laughs> So we'll do a dry walk back to the chairs. Well, she's gonna throw her trash away like a responsibility. And we'll do a dry walk over here to our chairs and get her some sun scran. All right, time to check out some whirlpool action. Oh, that's so much better. Is that better? I 
It's a little better than the cold pool. Well, that Mine's is refreshing. Better. Well, this is the opposite of what's refreshing, so. Ooh. Yeah, that's better. I could be in here all day, <laughs> all day long. You're not supposed to. Oh yeah, that's true. You gotta limit your exposure, huh? Then you gotta go jump back in the cold. No, uh-uh. So I live here now. That's where we live. It's my home. If y'all need us, it's where we are. So. It's really warm. It's nice. Yeah, it actually is really warm. Uh, they did good. On a scale of one to ten, yeah. how um, t uh, whirlpooled are you right now? Ten. Ten whirlpools? So nice. Yeah, you're, this, this is like the perfect body of water yes. for your coldness. So you're not allowed to say you're cold anymore while you're in the thing. It's perfect. It's you can like, be tired, but not it's cold. It's warmer than bath water, and I like oh, it. Oh, it's definitely warmer yeah. than bath water. I it's, love it. It's warmer than pee -pee. It makes you sleepy. Though. Warmer than bath water, warmer than everything. Exactly. Okay. It's nice, though. It's a nice big um, whirlpool, is what yeah. we call it, yeah. I don't know what the difference is like in a jacuzzi and a I whirlpool. Think, and a hot tub. I feel like jacuzzis are warmer. I don't know. This feels well, well but got hot tub there's hot jets tub. in here. They're just not on. Uh, so I don't really know the difference technically. Well, no, jacuzzi is a name brand. Oh, okay. But like between a whirlpool and a hot tub, I don't really know the difference. Well, we probably should have read these before we got in the whirlpool. But anyway, I don't think we uh, blatantly disobeyed any whirlpool rules. But we had a nice long soak. I'm pleasantly can't warm now. Can't bring no, there's no pants in here. Whoa, they're doing the dance party dances. They already did the wobble and the cupid and everything like that while we were in the hot tub whirlpool. Man. Oh, it started raining on us a we'll little bit. Yeah, we'll just kind of sit here. Baby steps. In the rain. Baby steps. Do, 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 do. No, none of that. None of that. Making it back down into the cold. It's a little overcast now. I don't mind the sun being gone, but you know, that's obviously not helping the temperature situation any. You don't get any redeeming sunshine out here now. You get used to it pretty quick. You do, actually. Yeah, it's so pretty. What I was saying to Jay earlier, if like, we were home and this was the temperature and we had a pool, would we actually get in it? No. I don't know, because you're on vacation, you have a different sense of adventure. So you're right. just like, get in, it's, it's the best vacation. <laughs> Well, I don't guess we can come here without looking at the beach, so we'll give it a shot. I don't know that any water is going to be entered, but we will come out here anyway. Yeah, we've definitely got some, uh, I guess that's uh, seagrass is what I'm seeing over there because it's kind of dark and you can kind of see it wave around when the waves come up. We'll come down here to the pretty part where there seems to be no seagrass. <laughs> Yeah, the ocean temperature is not terrible, but like you just said, not snorkable, snorkelable. Well, I'm not sure if this is part of the same property or not, but we're here. Yeah, we made it down to, I guess they said that's a hotel that looks like a cruise ship. They're currently closed for repairs. Now we're gonna do a little wander back. All right, time for washy washy. Don't turn on the wrong one. Whoops, yeah, we just noticed my shirt is starting to discolor it from black into a brown, so. There is some chlorine in play here, obviously, and it messes up my t-shirt. Well, I guess I'll see if I can get down in here to neck level bad. and discolor it at least all the same. Yeah, I have a couple of, like zebra stripes. Yeah, I have a couple of other discolored shirts, so those have become my swimwear. I think it was the hot tub that chlorined me, so I don't know the me being down in this pool. I feel like this pool is just salt water, but I bet that hot tub had the chlorine in it. I guess it don't lick it. Man, I'm not licking any of this water. That's gross. They are playing musical chairs back okay, there. We we're we're right back in here. land mode. But they're doing, right, uh, they had like a hula hoop thing up there earlier, so they got lots of fun and games going on here. Musical chairs is always you know fun what? though. One is flawed, one is dead. D is out there getting all sorts of selfies and pictures and social media. Look at that. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hey! Five, four, three, two, one, jump! Yeah, baby, yeah! They have got her wobbling and Cupid shuffling and all sorts of stuff out there. Ooh, she will dance all day. Five, two, three, four. So you got your dance on. Did you, you're not doing the water balloon contest. Let's go LA, let's go New York, let's go Miami. Do the Macarena, Macarena. Hey, hey, hey. Woo! 
So it is snack time. I think we're going to get an order of conch fritters and an order of loaded fries. We've seen some other folks with the fries, and it's a lot of fries. Can't be about that $10 hot dog life now. This this ain't Balmoral, but I mean, yeah. <laughs> like a summer sausage on a bun. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops, no go on the conch fritters. They said none of that, but we're going to get us some loaded fries anyway. Let's delve into this world of loaded fries, shall we? Wow. Oh, they got some jalapenos on there. It said jalapeno sour cream, but that is definitely some jalapenos. Get jalapeno business. No. No. Oh, she's boogieing. No. All right, I think we're coming over now to dip our feet in the chilly water just to have some refresh and visit our bird friends because, you know, they love us. Is it refresh? Yeah, it's refreshing. Oh, yeah. See, I knew the birds enjoyed hanging out with us. Caca! This is quite the happening spot here. All right, you need to stop bringing more friends because uh, so we have a lot of friends right now. Bird zoom, bird zoom. All right, it is bordering on three o'clock. I think we're gonna go catch the three o'clock bus shuttle dealy out of here and leave our beautiful, beautiful area. I know. I can just sit in that chair and look at that. It's yeah, true. It's very, well. Whoa, there's some, it is relaxing, there's some music. But there is a lively Yeah. <laughs> so you can have both. That's right. You sure do boogie. You boogie even if it's country music. Girl. Yeah, I don't know if all of this is accessible stuff. This seems like the stuff that you do have access to, maybe not as a guest, but I don't know. I'm sure they'll let you in the gift shop. <laughs> Pool and related facilities for use of registered guests only. But I guess uh, the day pass qualifies you as that. Oh, there's some other options. None of that really seemed to be operating too much, yeah. I think they really only had like the beach uh, shack open for us today. But that was good. Well, I'm not sure if this big bus is for us or not, but I guess we'll find out. We've got about 15 minutes until the next pickup at this location. Same company that brought us here, though. Good enough. They said this is our bus. Ship we're coming back to, and some shopping down there, and kaboom. Heading back into the terminal, they said you couldn't really record much of anything in here. I saw some signs, so we'll see you on the other side. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, they got cookies and beverages as soon as you get on the ship. Nice. Again, we are back on the ship from Freeport. Yeah. We got a little bit cleaned up because we're going to go get some lunchy, snacky things. Mm -hmm. How was your day at wherever we were, Lighthouse Point? It was great. Okay. So we'd been wanting to go there uh, and seen some vlogs about it in the past. Yeah. And uh, I think it definitely lived up to what I'd seen mm -hmm. other people experience there. Um, not everything was open. True. I don't think. I think it was kind of a quiet time in February. Well, we were the only ship in port. Yeah. As well. We a baby ship. <laughs> but it was really nice. The Infinity Pool. I've never been in an Infinity mm -hmm. Pool before, so that was awesome. Was it infinitely awesome? It was infinite. Yeah, that. Awesome. And the Whirlpool was nice and warm. It really was. The ocean was a little wavy. Did but uh, yeah. but it was nice, and then uh, food and drinks were good, reasonable price, I think. You know, for and my hot dogs, but still well, those fries for six dollars. Mm. You could definitely share that. That's what we did. Oh uh, yeah. So and staff was great. Um, they had lively atmosphere if you wanted it, or you could go away onto the beach if you wanted a little more secluded, True. quiet time. Um, yeah, no, it was really, really that nice. That was good. And we I booked definitely it, go back. Yeah, we booked it through the ship. We so did. you just check it out on the Bahamas Paradise Excursions Dealy Wheelie, and that's where it comes from. So. You also oh. had the option to go shopping, and they would pick you up oh, from right. that location, we too, didn't. at, was it Port Lucaya? The Lucaya Market. Lucaya Market. Yeah. It looked really nice. We just chose to stay the whole time and, and, and swim and have fun. So, yeah. But now it's snack time, so we back for snacks. 